Hey Libra, welcome back to my channel and welcome to any new viewers. I am Simone, the moon goddess. So Libra, this is your reading for career and money in the month of August. This will cover Li um, Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter signs. It's a general message, so you take what messages resonate and you leave the rest, okay? Um, anybody who's interested in a personal reading with me, all of my details are in the contact. The description box below. Follow me on Instagram, the Moon Goddess Tarot. Um, and subscribe if you're interested in being a part of my monthly giveaway for a free reading. All right, so Spirit Guides, Higher Self, Benevolent Ascended Ancestors. What messages do you want me to share with Libra when it comes to their career and money in the month of August? Career and money for Libra, Spirit Guides, Higher Self, Benevolent Senate, Ancestors, Holy Spirit. What messages do you want me to share with Libra? May they be for the highest good of all involved with harm to Nan Ashe. Oh, Libra, 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 Spirit Guides, Libra. What's the messages you want me to share with Libra for money? Temperance reversed. All right, Libra. So balance has to happen. Balance has to happen in August when it comes to your money. The fool. Wow. Okay. Bottom of the deck. So new journey. But look at him. Look at how he's like practically on the edge. And I don't know what's in that cup. But the fact that he's like tottering here teetering tottering on the edge of this cliff with a cup of something and this card temperance you see the cups are being poured but the fool took too much too much of what that was hang on let me just clear my camera i feel it's a bit fuzzy but the fool took way too much of whatever is in that cup and now acting a damn fool <laughs> so libra watch out for that um balance has to happen in your um money nine of coins is at the top of the deck so you are headed towards this or you are already feeling this energy that sense of financial independence grounding living the good life you've worked hard and you're you're attracting your prosperity and your abundance and you are enjoying yourself Libra is ruled by Venus. Y'all like the good life, so that's understandable. But watch out for being the fool. Ace of Stas is here. So definitely new beginnings here with this fool energy. But with within that, there also must be... You have to temper your energies. All right? You need to temper your energies, Libra. The chariot is here. So there's a chance for you to go forward with real strength. Wow, under that chariot is the king of coins hello all right so that's the real manifestations right there all right that's you living that good life luxury luxury just like luxuriating in it being master of your domain when it comes to drawing in prosperity and abundance and all that good stuff maybe even promotion um being celebrated recognized but there is a chance for you for it to go possibly go to your head and you end up splurging it or i don't know losing it investing it in the wrong place some kind of some kind of vibe <sighs> okay spirit guys assist me in, ch in clarifying these cards for libra assist me in clarifying these cards for libra let's make this video nice and short because I am boiling. <laughs> okay. I look gorgeous though. <laughs> My skin's all like glowy. So there's that. Okay. I'm a Libra rising. So. <laughs> feeling myself a little bit today. 
why is this temperance card here for libra spirit guides why is the temperance card here for libra spirit guides why is this temperance card here for libra for their career and money in august spirit guides why is the temperance card here spirit guides Temperance is also associated with Sagittarius energy. It's card number 14. I don't know if that number resonates with any of you. Um, yeah, I feel like for Libra, y'all going to be like giving away something. Why is the Temperance card here? For Ace of Wands. Hmm. Why is the temperance card here for Libra spirit guides? Make it nice and clear. Why is the temperance card here for Libra spirit guides? Make it nice and clear. Why is the temperance card here? Thank you. Okay. So Ten of Pentacles is here. You got Nine of Pentacles and Ten of Pentacles here on this table. All right. So you want to bring some balance into your financial situation into how much you give away of yourself as well how much you give away of your time for some of you who are um business owners small business owners etc i feel like you might be giving away your time for nothing maybe you need to like push your prices up a little bit i feel i don't know that just came to me um but whatever is happening here that's out of balance maybe where you are now you feel out of balance with your money but what's coming if you play your cards right with these aces is the opportunity to build something really solid and, and stable here with this ten of pentacles um and this ace of wands something's going to stir you up though all right, so this could be fire here again, again, because you've got Sagittarius with a temperance card and to clarify, it's this Ace of Wands. So that could be Aries, Leo or Sagittarius energies. Um, and then this Ten of Pentacles, that is Virgo energy. Traditionally, it could also be Capricorn or Taurus. Um, a sense of grounding, a sense of coming together. Maybe that's what you need to do, like work with somebody, work with a number of people in order to bring in this money like you have this nine of coins energy that sense of independence um but maybe you could get even further if you worked with people you know that's more energy putting in so that's more coming back to you all right and I said that, and here's the Three of Pentacles at the bottom of that, which is that collaboration card. All right, that's that collaboration card right there. Okay, so yeah, I feel like maybe part of your abundance and prosperity is working with others. Working with others. Um, for some reason, I don't feel like y'all want to, but there's an ace here another actually you have ace of wands twice i just realized you have ace of wands twice here so definitely some new fires coming in something is going to stir you up inspire you in some way um maybe your new thought would be to work with others maybe before you felt as if you just wanted to try to do things because, you know, you hear the horror stories of working with people or switching a relationship into a business partnership or working with a best friend or whatever. And you get this sense of, you know, you don't want things to fall apart. But I feel like part of your prosperity is working with others here. It's coming through strong. Why is this fool card here for Libra Spirit Guys when it comes to your career and money in August? Why is the fool card here, Spirit Guys? judgment wow okay judgment hmm so you got the beginning and nearly the end of the journey with this judgment card like awakening and i feel okay so what it is is that if you don't bring some balance into your finances or how you work with people you could end up pushing yourself over the edge all right you could end up ending end up in a 
uncompromising situation or some kind of hardship if you don't bring some balance if you don't spread some of I feel like some of you might be spreading yourself thin and you know you're looking to end up in a sticky situation right it's time to wake up and it's time to accept the gifts on offer from the universe whatever that is for you this ace of wands maybe it's a person coming in saying hey let's work together could be a sagittarius because sagittarius energy is coming through strong here um maybe an aquarius with this fool card because it that's uranus uranus rules aquarius um but I feel like some of you need to wake up and wake up quick because you are, you have the potential to fall over the cliff, whatever your cliff is in your real life, right? Temperance is here. I don't know, maybe y'all spending too much money in the good life because you got this nine of coins energy here, which is feeling yourself. You've got that money. You work hard. You play hard. Um, maybe whatever is in the cup, whether it's shopping literally alcohol or drugs or some kind of something that's out of balance and if you don't be mindful and you don't pay attention to the messages you're getting because you know you get messages knowing you know full well when you're kind of like off your own path off the off your purpose and your mission right and if you don't pay heed to that there is a poss potential for you to go hurtling off the edge of the cliff all right so be mindful of that libra um why is this nine of coins here for libra for their career and money in august two of swords reversed all right so some kind of decision to be made something that you've decided maybe that's you collaborating why is this nine of coins here can you make it more clear spirit guys for libra for career and money in august why is this nine of coins here for Libra spirit guys, thank you. Ace of Swords, you got three aces now. All right, so you got this two of swords reverse and ace of swords. So there's open communication here. Maybe even thinking clearly, maybe before, and I feel like this has to do with you collaborating. Um, before you might have been like, no, I want to do my own thing. It's easier if I, you know, if I'm my own boss and I do everything myself. And the now you're realizing, hang on, actually, I can't do it all. Um, and I'd be more successful if I collaborated with people. So you're making that decision to have some sort of conversation, communication, maybe thinking clearly. You can see clearly now, you know which path to go in. Maybe working on a business plan. So you got three aces here, three beginnings here. You got the full card, so that's the beginning as well. Ace of Wands, twice, and Ace of Swords. Energy, that is crazy. Why is this Ace of Staffs here for Libra, Spirit Guides? For career and money. Why is the Ace of Staffs here for career and money in August, Spirit Guides? Thank you. Ten of Wands. Yep. Letting go of some of the weight. Letting go of some of that weight. Ashe. So I feel that this is exactly it. You, the Spirit is asking you, Libra, in August, if you want to like take it to the next level, delegate, share, collaborate. Okay collaborate work with work somebody's going to approach you if they haven't already if they haven't already and there's a real potential for some serious prosperity to flow in if you work with this person here all right and it also means that you can like let go some of the weight and um maybe you let go of nine wands and just hold the one that is the most valuable the most profitable for you and you can see everything clearly in front of you now that you have just that one that you're focused, you're focused. Maybe that's what it is as well. Maybe Libra, your mind is all over the place with all these different plans and ideas. You've got all these great plans and ideas, but it's about being focused and directing your energy in such a way that will bring you back, you know, that will take you further rather than being all over the place and just going around in circles and being like this fool. Right? <sighs> yep. Seven of Wands here. Yep. Maintaining ground because now you don't have a whole bunch of wands carrying around. Going nowhere fast kind of vibe. 
What's the word of advice for career and money in August for Libra spirit, guys? What's the word of advice? Queen of Cups reversed. So I don't know if there's a sense you need to like remove yourself from like um what's the word I want? Separate yourself from or separate your emotions from this from work and money. Separate your emotions and being practical, being clear, being um, logical, being straight. Five of Wands reverse, bottom of the deck. So it's about not you, not fighting yourself, um, fighting like you know your higher higher self telling you 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 know you better do X Y Z. You get off better that way. And uh, aspects of you are like, no, 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 no. I want to do it all. I want to do it. No, I've done it before and it's happened this way. And I don't want it to happen this way again. And some kind of vibe here. But Wheel of Fortune is here, top of the deck. So you might meet, if you haven't already, you might meet the, the person for you that will take you to the next level. Why is this Queen of Cups here for, for, for Libra Spirit Guides? Why is this Queen of Cups here for Libra Spirit Guides? Why is the Queen of Cups here for Libra Spirit Guides? Thank you. Are you kidding me? Temperance reversed again. Libra, what is going on? You have two temperance cards, both reversed. Y'all is a sign of balance. Y'all is a sign of the scale. So it, God bring some balance here. Um, I feel like y'all being overly emotional, maybe. Maybe being overly stubborn or holding on too tightly to something. Not wanting to share. Not flowing. Not following the breadcrumbs. Maybe too attached. Too attached to this situation with your money. You need to be more practical. You need to be more Ace of Swords. You need to be more... Um, look at the bigger picture of the situation. And not be so emotional with it. Also know that you're guided. And y'all really need to cut to connect with your intuition as well. And also you need to receive. Like when you're offered assistance, you should receive be grateful. Cause I get the feeling that Libra is not really accepting things in. Libra has an idea of how things should be, how things should fall into place. And you're holding on tightly to it, even though you are blocking yourself in some way. What's the potential obstacles and blockages for Libra? Knight of Wands reversed. Um, yeah, maybe being overly stubborn. Again, you have this idea of how things should be and you don't want to let go of it. You got to flow. The magician, yep, you got to flow, Libra. You are the master of your domain. You have all the resources around you to make your energies flow and to manifest and to attract what you want. But it's how you go about it. It's like. Yeah. I feel like Libra. Your message is. To relinquish control. And follow your breadcrumbs. Follow your guidance. There's aces. There's so much new energy here. But. If you keep holding on and doing things from an old way or trying to trying to control the situation or trying to do things all on your own, it will be counterproductive to you. Okay. What's the possible out final outcome for this situation for career and money in, in August for Libra? Make it nice and clear, Spirit Guides. What's the final outcome for career and money? Page of Pentacles reverse. Yep. So... You can miss out on something good if you don't be mindful, Libra. There's a gift on offer you missing it. There's something being offered to you and you're missing it. You're actually 
protecting yourself from it when it's actually not an attack it's a gift maybe somebody's saying to you that you should do things in another way and you being product protective of your vision but missing the bigger picture why is this page of pentacles here yep nine of wands reversed so it's gone from you wanting to be in control or do things how you want to not to then getting stubborn and not want to do anything at all so then you just stop yourself from doing anything it's the energies that i'm getting here so libra your message for august is to let go flow with things allow people to assist you also um Be clear in your thoughts. Don't let success go to your head. Don't get too excited too quickly. You know, don't overindulge or not at all. You know, don't overwork or not at all. Don't over, don't play too much or not at all. Bring balance, balance, balance. Balance is your word. Balance is your word. The fool is here. Ashe, you got the fool twice. So definitely a new journey here. But it's how, how it's the, um... It's the, I just had the word, it's how you're going to go about it that will make all the difference. It's your strategies that will make all the difference here. What's the message you want me to share with Libra Spirit Guides for August when it comes to career and money? What's the message you want me to share with Libra for career and money? Spirit Guides for Libra. Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter. What's the message you want me to share with Libra for career and money in August? What's the message Spirit Guides you want me to share with Libra? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter for career and money in August. What's the message Spirit Guides you want me to share with Libra for career and money in August? What's the message you want me to share with Libra for career and money in August, Spirit Guides? just realized that I have one card missing which is probably why okay sorry sorry Libra there is a card on the floor sorry what's the message for Libra spirit guides for career and money what's the message for Libra spirit guides for career and money in August career and money in August spirit guides and money in August spirit guys for Libra what's the message you want me to share for Libra <laughs> look at the bigger picture the amount of times I said this to you Libra Ashe look at the bigger picture that you can get so far by yourself yeah and you can draw in that money and live that good life for you or you can take it to a whole other level and work with those who can assist you and take you ever so further you know it's that vibe don't let pride get in your way libra ashe well prosperity lies ahead is a card under that and under that is step out of your comfort zone okay libra well Believe in the impossible. There's a card at the top. I don't know. I, hang on, sorry. And a new start is coming. So Libra, those are your messages for August for career and money. I hope the messages have helped, resonated in some way. If they have, drop a comment, like the video, share it, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you know that I've posted a new video. Libra, step out of your own way and let the abundance and the prosperity flow to you in August, okay? Big love to you and until next video, bye.